What's up, everybody? It's Dirt. I'm going to try and keep this pretty short. Uh, I don't know how long this is going to be, but I'm, this is going to be a little tutorial video to show you how to play with the ninja properly, uh, or how I play with it, I guess. So let's go get into a realm. Okay, let's get in, we'll just get into Medusa. Uh, first, you can see that I have all tops, but it's fine. Just try and learn from my techniques, not necessarily what I'm wearing. Um, the main part of killing gods on a ninja is knowing their pattern. So, um, when you're in the godlands, you need to know what, how, how gods shoot, and um, how much they like, uh, what is it called? They try and pre-shoot you, like, which way you're going. So if you kind of do the side movement on, let me try and show you, and then if there's a lot, sometimes you can use that, and you just have to kind of know where things are and watch out for the big shots, um, so on a ninja, the big shots are uh, going to be the, what is it, the ghost god and the beholders, because those, those are going to hurt the most, uh, don't treat me, um, so, see, you can you can pretty much juke out the white demons. You're not really gonna need. I would go in that lab, but okay. And then I got slowed. Uh, and you do want to use your ninja star every once in a while. Um, I'm actually gonna do the lab and come back if I can get to it in a second. Hold up. I'll come back. I'll come back. Oh my word, I'm going to die. And now it's gone. Never mind. Uh, okay, let me just keep going. Okay, so the beholders, you can't really, they don't really have a pattern necessarily. Um, but demons, if you're going to be killing them, they have a pattern. Uh, the slimes have a pattern, but they have a fast um, like fire rate, I guess. So you just have to be careful not to hit, get the slow. Uh, on them. That's mainly what I try and watch out for. They, uh, they should be pretty easy, the, the gins. Um, what I do on, to Medusa is I kind of just circle them. I mean, they, their fire rate so slow, you just kind of circle them and watch out for the bombs. Um, and if you have a Ray Katana, it's a much different story. Like, you can basically just stay back pretty far and not even have to worry about the patterns necessarily um, now those you kinda just have to okay um, for the white demons no no for the djinn what no I don't know what those are called but um, the djinns uh, I know are no no the ghost gods I am so lost right now uh, the ghost gods are what I'm trying to talk to you about those guys and I'm gonna die. <laughs> Let me see if I can get rid of the other two. Okay, so these guys, what you wanna do, when he shoots, you go into the little slit of one, shoot, go back out. And that's all that's basically my my strategy to kill them. Is go into the little slit between two of them. Shoot it, go back out, take however long it needs. Um, so the next thing um, uh, for the speedy part, some people use like the tier zero speedy thing because they'll be they'll want to do speedy and then you know like speedy and then let go. And on a doom circle, when you do the speedy, um, that takes away the. I mean, it takes away a lot of MP from that. Some people don't really want that, but some do. Um, so, I'm going to do this lab, and I'll come back in a minute. Okay, I'm back, uh, and I'm going to do the rest of the video now that I did the lab. Um, these guys, if you're, if you're max enough, you can kill them pretty easily. Um, uh, just to kill them out of the way if they're kind of annoying. Uh, by the way, uh, the 
the Ninja has a really high DPS, and it's really nice that the shots um, of the katanas go through the enemies. So if you're in the if you're in a castle, um, then it's really really nice. Uh, just because it shoots through all the enemies. Uh, I'll put up some stats right now um, that show the the DPS of it uh, and uh, like what the max stats are, in case you don't know. Uh, and that's basically all I need to tell you about. I mean, uh, you can just watch me play for a second. If you do have the Raikatan, I'll give this extra tip. It's just... If you ever got it, I got it, I bought it for, like, I think 8 life. When, like, right when Soulbound came back on, and people were selling stuff, I bought it, I bought it for 8 life. But it's not necessary, I've, I've been playing with it, playing on Ninja a while without it, so it's not necessary. But, it is a nice thing to have, if you, if you do have it, it's very nice to play with, or if you were to afford it, um... And the thing is, uh, the ninja is a very fragile class. So you don't want to be like, even though it does a high DPS, like the melees and stuff, and it has that length of a melee, you're not going to want to use it necessarily as much, just because it, it only has like 46 max def with my with my uh, gear. Um, so I think that's basically all I need to talk about. Um, whichever class you guys want me to talk about next just leave that in the comments and I will do my best to do that class so uh, thanks for wa watching and I uh, hope that uh, helped you learn more about the ninja and how to play it and I hope to see more of you being on ninjas in the future thank you and have a nice day